Folks, how would you like to go on a tomato hornworm hunt with us? Sound good, Char? All right, let's go. Now, right here is our tomato patch. And this is where the tomato hornworms live. Now, you don't have to worry about being quiet. It ain't like hunting things where you have to be quiet and talk real quiet so they won't hear you and get spooked. You don't have to worry about that when you're hunting tomato hornworms. There's a few different options of how to find them. One is if you've got holes in your tomatoes. I don't see any holes here on these. Do you, Char, do you see any holes? No. No. Another way to hunt tomato hornworms is to look for their look for their mess oh yeah yeah look for their mess their poop and that's a good way to find them you gotta look down under the plants now i know there's one in here because i've done seen the sign of him but i wanted to make sure and come back and get you in on this hunt with us all right now look Come here, Char. The tomato hornworm's poop looks like Legos. Okay? Now, right here on the ground, if you look real close, see that down there on the ground, Char? What? Looks like a Lego. Uh, that poop. Is it? Yeah. See that poop? It looks like a Lego. Uh huh. Oh, there's three. Look here, there's another. There's a whole pile of it. See there, it looks like, just like Legos. Now over here's a good example, right here. See that? Looks just like Legos. That is tomato hornworm poop. And it's a good way, they, they're hard to see when they're on the plant. But if you know what to look for, you can find where they're at because they eat and they have to go to the bathroom. Now right here, you can see a little damage right here. See that damage on this plant where something's been chewing on it looks like? See there, Char? Right there? Yep, that's Thanks, right, sir. right there. So there's definitely a worm on this plant. Yeah. Now, like I said, if you look for poop on the ground, See damage on your tomato plants? Hopefully they ain't got to you tomatoes with that big horn yet. And poked a hole in them. We got him early, looks like. There's just a little bit of poop there. If you keep an eye out for the poop and the ground's clean, there ain't many weeds, you can see it. You can catch these things before they damage your stuff. Now, do you see him anywhere, Char? Sure. It's a big old green worm. Big. Alright. Big old green worm. I don't see any. You don't see it nowhere? No. Nope. Oh, look here. Look here. Come here. What's that right there in the middle? What? See it right there in the middle? You see it? What? It's so green. You see it? Look at there, what we found. Look at that big red horn on his tail. Wait, let me see. See it? Horn on his tail? See it there? See that red horn? Red? Boy, he's a eating a snack, and I'm going to go around to the other side. What? I don't see red. Right here now. Now see? You can see his poop over here, too. See mm -hmm. right there? Mm -hmm. Looks like Legos. Look right up under here where he's hiding. Look right up under here. Look at there. Good night. Look at that worm. What? Golly. Yeah, that's yeah, that horn's oh. on his tail. I thought it was on his tail. See down there's his mouth. He's down there eating on our mater plant. Ooh. See that big horn on his tail? Uh huh. That's what they use to poke them maters so they can start eating on them. What if you touch it? That won't hurt you. Should I pet it? I wouldn't pet it. 
but we'll get it off her so it won't hurt her so it won't hurt our mater plant Ooh, wow now right there that's his mouth the opposite end of the horn right there that's where he does the eating right there see that that's his mouth now they got a pretty good grip so you have to you have to wrestle them loose. He'll probably try to poop on me or pee on me. <laughs> they got a grip like you would not believe. They can hold on to them mater plants. See, he, what he thinks is he thinks he's a predator here that is trying to eat him. To attack him like this. Yeah, he <laughs> thinks we're going to eat him, which if we had some chickens to throw him to. But we don't like him. We don't now, like him. No, he just come loose, one foot loose. You gotta, I mean, he's pulling on them maters, son. They get a bite. Now we got him, see there? Ooh. Look at that. Now see, he's done eat this leaf completely off right there. Right there. See right there, that leaf's completely gone. Oh my gosh. Now look at him, he's look trying to, eyes. watch him, watch him. He's trying to bite me. Pops a little eyes. Yeah, he's trying to bite me, look at him. Oh my gosh. See him trying to bite me? Yeah. Look at them painters. Oh, he looks like he's spraying something. I guess I'm mashing the, the mater juice out of him, I guess. Ew. But you can see. I'm going to lay him down right here where we can deal with him. Yeah, that's, look at there. He got that old mater juice on me. Ugh, that's nasty. He ain't too spry now. But you can see he's done eat a whole stem off right here. <laughs> oh look at that whole God. leaf off of that stem. What about there, there? I don't see no more spots, but that's down there on the ground. Now we're gonna have to compost him, so we won't we won't put that on YouTube. It's gonna be a pretty gruesome scene. But if I advise you to go out in your tomato patch and go on a horn worm hunt, now that you know how to track them and hunt them, and let us know. Let us know if you get any. Also... I hadn't seen any signs, like I say, on these maters. But look right here, on this one mater right here. See if I can get the camera on it. You can see what it's done. See there? It spiked our mater, but it's healing up. Now over here is our tomato hornworm hound. Hey, bear. Hey, bear. There he is. That's our tomato hornworm hound. Now he got in a fight the other day. Look here, bear. Look here at this hornworm. Look here. Look here. Skid it, boy. Skid it. Skid it, boy. Now, bear got in a fight with a bear, I think, the other day, and it tore his face up. It looks like it pawed him one good time. Scratched old bear's face. See them scars there? But he's all right, thank goodness. He's all right. Bear, look, look. And if you don't have a tomato hornworm hound, that's okay. You can hunt without a hound. We're just high tech around here, ain't we, Char? Yeah. Bear, look. All right, folks. This is me and Charlotte and bear hunting tomato hornworms. I hope this is encouraging. Onions, go out and find some of your own. <laughs> Pops. Yep. He didn't step on it. No, he didn't, did he? No, he didn't. That's rude.